Hey groovers, movers and shakers, we're going to do another fast and furious little cook up here. Uh, I'm a big fan of spaghetti alio olio, I think I got the pronunciation for that right, which is just literally spaghetti tossed in extra virgin olive oil with a bit of garlic and some fresh herbs. It's really, really tasty, really, really simple. We're going to do something similar to that, except I'm going to combine it a little bit with kind of a broccolini almondine, except different. So, you know, just follow along. Uh, we've got a bit of butter melting. I'll throw some red onion diced up and some garlic in there. I'm also going to throw some bacon in there. Of course, you don't have to have the bacon. Or you can use something different to bacon. You could use chorizo or sausage or a little bit of chicken, whatever you want. Or you could just have it just really basic and simple. This is the whole point of cooking. It, you do it to your own taste. Do it to make it nice for you. So we've got that butter melted. The fat from the bacon will be rendering down. And I'm going to put a little bit of olive oil in there as well, just to coat the pasta. And then I'm going to throw in the broccolini. Just enough to soften that slightly. Really good to keep it uh, crunchy and crisp. Really tasty. Pinch of salt, sea salt of course. Uh, instead of almonds, I'm going to use pecans. Fresh herbs from the garden, basil, oregano and a little bit of thyme. Now you can cook the bacon longer if you like it crispy. Oh, I don't need to do that right now. Toss the pasta in. A little bit more olive oil just to coat that. And of course you can use any kind of oil you want. Look at that, isn't that amazing? Give that a second just to heat the pasta through. Over here, as always I'm working one handed so it's a little bit tricky to toss things around. Squeeze a lime. Oh, I have run out of parmesan cheese, so I've got a little bit of grated cheddar. I'm going to throw that through. And I do like my chili flakes, but today I'm in the mood for something a bit spicier. So we've got some diced habanero chili, the king of chilies, the fruity king of chilies. Yum, yum. And look at that. That's amazing. And that's ready to go. Put a bit of black pepper on and you have your lunch. Yum, yum. And what did that take? Two minutes and 58 seconds. Bye now.